right, so we're going out of void. We're starting with Red Dead because I realized time management. And it's going to be a thing today. So we're starting with Red Dead instead of the other thing. Because I think that we should do that first. Because last time we didn't start with Red Dead, we barely had time for Red Dead. But this time we're starting with Red Dead, so I have better time management. So we have two hours for Red Dead. I'm borrowing my game getting canceled due to the rain, which I don't know what's going to happen. I will know when I know. That's how my job works. I'll know when I know. And we will adjust accordingly, depending on what my boss says. So it might be like a last minute thing where my boss texts me saying, by the way, the game's canceled. I may have to text your mom saying, game's canceled. Uh, we're readjusting. All right. <laughs> it's going to be our usual time. Yeah, whatever. We'll see what happens. Right. It's either going to be 6.30 you're leaving or 8. It's just going to depend on whether the game's happening or not. Hopefully the game happens because I really want to broadcast today. All right, so two hours so far for Red Dead. Only two hours, but that could change. We might get an extra hour depending on what Tim says. And I don't know what Tim says because Tim hasn't emailed me yet. Right. So. I wish you didn't have to know the day of. You That's how sports work. Yeah, I wish. <laughs> I wish you knew by like yesterday. Well, it's an outdoor event, so they can't know. The, the I'm just saying that's what I prefer if I had to know. Like, <laughs> it'd be it'd be really shit if my job was like, hey, I need you to work today. Well, you're retail. I'm sports. Yeah. And sports are usually day of. <laughs> that's how it works, unfortunately. Because you can't predict the weather. It could rain. It could not rain. We don't know. The weatherman could say it can rain, and it doesn't. But then it says it'll be sunny, and then it rains. It happens. <laughs> That's the problem. Your mic's all screwed up. I'm just playing with it. Oh, oh really? Nice. All right. Let's fix that. Okay, so, I guess we should get that stranger mission out of the way. We only have two hours though, so I'd like to get some main missions done too. Though. Yeah, I'm very good too. Well, two hours is usually our normal time for this. Thank God. Last time we only had half an hour, which sucked. Yeah. Okay, so you got to. So we're trying to start this You're 12 me, huh? We got till we'll 3 o'clock. Give you an extra 10 minutes. What you fools up to? It's Mr. Black's fault. His fault to Darky White. Although I don't know why they call him that. Look at him. Don't you start now. I'll knock the color clean off you. Come on. And I'll right. tall you, you lily livered. Enough. Huh. You two fools look like you've just run off a chain gang. Yeah, what of it? What are you doing? Starving. They got bounty posters for us all over town. And we can't go into town to get supplies. Say, mister, maybe you can do us fools a favor. We ain't bad guys at all. He's okay, even for a darkie. Shut up, you pasty face streak of piss. Yeah, I had up to here with you. No. Do your goddamn favor what you want. Maybe you can go into town and take down them wanted posters of us. <sighs> okay. Maybe meet us back at the campfire in the woods and tell us how you did. Uh, maybe bring us a little bite to eat. Don't push your luck. Nice fella. Yeah, you love nice fellas. Don't you start up again. Just shut up. You shut up! All right, take down those wanted posters around rows to stop the bounty hunters searching for Mr. Black and Mr. White. They're right around the same area. Well, there's your horse. <laughs> hey, I need to get to that poster behind you. Will you move a little? <laughs> I will not. Deputy put up plenty. Go get one of those. Please, mister, I'll just reach by. It won't take but a second. I'm leaning on it. Find one that ain't in use. 
Hey, move. I need that poster. Oh, I'll move, all right. How's this for moving? No damn man. Let's do this. Bounty hunting. Bounty hunting. Oh, he wants. He was like in your way, and you had. Like, to. no, I'm not gonna move out your way. Fuck you. And I'm like, all right, fuck you too. Then, and then we, then we fought for the right for the poster, and I won. Wait, is that really your hat? I can... Yeah. I hate darkness. Wait. Why do we have to do this? Wait, no, wait, no, it's not. <laughs> That's not your hat. It's not my hat. <laughs> Uh, is that your hat? Oh, well, it's temporary. But as usual, you're spreading lies. Lies? Every fool knows the charges were trumped up. But the darky killed a white man. Jimmy Holdaker had a weak heart. He died. This should take place because Rose is just a town, right? It's in Rose, right? I'll post it. It's not like St. Denis. Everyone knows Judge Amory took a bribe. You don't believe that, do you? Sure. Do you call me a gossip? Apparently, it's entirely possible that they didn't do it. Yeah, forgive me if I check my phone every now and again because we're not. Ah, no, carry him. Because I have to do time management, and last time I wasn't good at that. <laughs> and uh, you called me out for that. You were like, Dave, you weren't time Listen, management. You didn't have to do time management. There's been a recall. Okay. I wasn't born yesterday. Why are you going to start this out with the go to the show thing? I wanted to do this first. It's better time management if we do this first, get as much as we can done, and then go to the, do the other things. Hey, I should have done that in the first place, hey. but I wasn't thinking that day. So. Here's a tip for Rosa to show skip as many cutscenes as you can. Other than the podcast, because it'll make things go faster. The hell you Get this off of me. All right, so he took the poster and we uh, do them for it. Yeah, because he took it. Do uh, him for the poster. The hell are you doing? This is uh, very kind of you. Those boys was mine. Why is it buying us a stranger mission? Yeah. Oh, I guess yeah. It's a side mission. I'm assuming based on how fast you're doing this, you're going to No, it's, honestly, it's just been lucking out. You brought hell down on yourself. I'm taking a lock in the What? We You messed up this time. I'm assuming your father went up because she did that, not down. Yeah, my arm went up because that guy wanted to do awful, awful things to that girl. So me intervening gave me an honor, made my honor go up. And he pulled a knife out at me, so it's not like... Oh, I did some research for WWE 2K22. Yeah. There is no specific order. That's the major problem with the WWE 2K22, my yeah. career, is that there is no specific order. You can go in anywhere you wish, and sometimes the story won't make sense because you go in a certain weird order. That's the problem. That's the only issue with the game, is that there is no specific order. So we can do the tournament thing, and it won't matter. Oh, okay. So we don't have to go in... And there's no specific order, apparently. It's not linear. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's the problem. Got it. <laughs> it is non-linear. But if you want certain um, storylines, you have to like do them all in a certain way. But I didn't get that far. All I know okay. is that certain storylines can't be completed because you have to do a certain thing to get it. 
So we'll cross the bridge when we get there. But apparently we're fine so far. Alright. Kinda sucks there's no specific order. I know you like that in stories when there's like a specific order and yeah. this is that very You gotta do all of this that way in order to get hundred percent. Yeah, it's kind of the storylines are like in your social medias or um in the areas, that's it. You don't have to worry anymore. So there. You told me to research, I did research, and I came up with well there is no order. <laughs> it's just do the storylines. Find the fifth one. Yeah. <sighs> well, no, I'm not the same part. Fifth one. It will probably be either on a tree or a wanted poster more, right? Or a post. Yeah. It could be on a tree. Alright. Just in case you start getting angry, I'm going to go into the guide because I know I have guides for stranger missions. I don't need the weather forecast. I found it. I just needed to uh give you a little shit, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so <laughs> No, I'm gonna go to the guy. I found it! I, oh, I found it! <laughs> now I gotta meet them in the woods. Our next mission is Hosea when we get to main missions, just to let you know. I think I remember it's Hosea next. Alright, now we gotta find them in the woods. Oh, they're over there. There? Yep, yeah, chain gang. Up, doggo. We have shit to do. Not right now, doggo. I will pet you later. I wish we did this in the daytime. It would have been much easier. Oh, me too. Me too. Yep. Um, you're stuck in the yeah. fence. <laughs> I don't know if you did that on purpose for the last or... No. No. <laughs> no. I wish I did do that on purpose, but I didn't. <laughs> I know, it feels weird we didn't do a split live stream first. Yeah. <laughs> Today. I was like, alright, I'm gonna sit down, Dave's gonna do some sports. I was like, oh, we're loaded up late there, by the way. Oh, alright. Mm. Yeah, then you, well, yesterday you were at work, and I was doing a live stream yesterday, but you were at work. Yeah, so like, so. We missed that one. But hey, in, friend. It was a problem, Hello. So. How was it in town? Pretty hot. There's quite a price on you yeah, boys. Yeah, ended up winning 16 it to so 2. so unfair. I, I didn't do like, nothing. Are they really this bad? Apparently they're not, because in real life the Red Sox sucks, so... You killed a farmer? Uh, well, firstly, I don't know. These games unrealistic. I mean, they changed difficulty. Secondly, Back to rookie. Well, he had it coming. Too easy to hit. He, I got like six home runs. I'm like, like okay, I may need to change the difficulty to rookie. Well, Too easy. I think I got hitting down. Right. Ain't no business of mine. Here's the posters. Here's the posters. Burn them. Thanks, partner. And that's the thing that's mission that, completed. So well, now what are we gonna do? What was the plan? I remember we had to do this. What was the other thing we were gonna do? Um. Are we just going back to Hosea? Do we do a? Are we doing a? Are we doing Margaret? I don't uh, we're gonna do. Let's see. We're gonna do a bounty. Then we're gonna go to Mary. Not Mary Beth. Mary L Linton. Yeah, and then we're doing Jose. Uh, then we're doing Jose. Okay, so we're gonna go to the bounty poster then. Yeah, we're gonna go do that one. There's more like stuff to do with like uh, Mr. Black and Mr. White, but like, I don't know where they are. So we're done with that for now. We're done with that for now. Oh, is this the county jail? No, it's more like, uh... It's always, it's different in this town, where it's like, instead of like, at the station, it's at a train station. Because this is where everyone would go, I guess. Uh, 
bounty for Mark Johnson. Not one up then, are you? It's a decent bounty. Mark Johnson, H. Thomas. Captured alive, last seen in Siltwater Strand. Reward, get money. You only get twenty-five dollars. I have to know that feller is farming the swamp, or trying to, up by Siltwater Strand. He's a bad egg. Fancy that. I seen them coming and going here, and I never had an inkling. Hello again, sir. Okay, Mark Johnson and Stiltwater Strand. Thank God, it's daytime. Right. Oh, Thank God, girl. at least you can see. Yeah, I can see now. <laughs> Okay, so he's over there. He's not far away. He's they're never far I, away. I like that it's not far away. Not only because of like convenience, but it's like why would you advertise for something that's like five miles away? They're like, I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that for fifty bucks or whatever, right? Yeah. So do you like this order better? First Red Dead, then Road to the Show, then WWE. Does that work better for you? I think that's good. Because that way there you have as much time as you can for Red Dead, then we do the other Miscellaneous. Yeah. Because Red Dead's a big ass game. Right, and I feel like we need more time for it. Yeah. yeah. And I don't want to be stuck on this game until the fucking next year, so we yeah. need we need some time for this shit. <laughs> oh my god, it's something exploded. Oh no, an event! And you got off your horse. You got off your horse, fuck. <laughs> horse is always an event on the way. Yeah, it's always. <laughs> Your horse is gonna die if you're not careful. Oh, the horse ran away. They're fucking everywhere. We just want to do some bounty hunting. Leave us alone. Blew up a wagon. <laughs> it seems like we're doing good on time. Oh no, we got ambushed. I mean, part of me likes that. You know, there's something going on. Yeah. Like the word's not empty and shit can happen. I'm getting like two dollars, five bucks. I'm probably gonna get more from these guys than the fucking bounty itself. Not even counting, like... See, that dude has five bucks. Hmm. Alright, let's check here. Oh yeah, when gunfights happen, uh, your horse fucks off. It doesn't stand there and get shot. Your horse can get shot to death, they can, by like other people, but they don't go out of the way to target a horse. The only way your horse would get hit is if you're like on the horse. So wait, if this horse dies, is this the only raven horse in the game? No, it will respawn. Oh shit, you have to go days. back and get it. Yeah, and you have to go back and get it. Oh my god, no. Oh my god, wait, no. I <laughs> no, if you lose this horse, we'll get the second best horse. Yeah. Fuck that. <laughs> like this is the best horse early in the game. It's not the best horse ever of all time. There is, but you have to buy it. Oh, well, no. <laughs> At least it's a safe money. But in this, we have to find... But for this horse, we have to find it. Now we gotta find this guy. Apparently, he's just a farmer doing stupid shit. He's some guy that did crimes and tried to be a farmer. And now we're gonna go find his ass. We ain't going to you Capture him alive. Do not kill him. <gasps> They're here for your bounty. Up to mama boy. You're gonna do this. Don't shoot. I'm an arm. Has to. We knew you was pacifist, coming. I hope. <laughs> if we can. I got something to ask. Uh, that'll be the I'm idea. I'm a changed we'll man, okay? Let me say my farewells. I'll come away peaceable. 
Make it quick. You're a forgiven man. Boy. Boy, come here. Listen. Exactly as I say. You hear? Don't. Don't. I ain't gonna fight you in front of my family. Okay? This moment. You're the man now. He was the, the easiest man, fucking bounty we've had. Yeah. All he said was, okay, let accept your client. All right, look, let me talk to my family. I'm like, I will let you do that, yes. I'll let you say bye to your family. Enough with that. Just remember what I said, boy. That was like the easiest bounty we've ever done. It was like, hey, let me talk to my family. Got okay. You. I talked to my family. You can take me to the police. I'm like, uh, what the hell? Option two. Let me talk to my family. Fuck you. <laughs> that, that, that's option two. And maybe option three is shoot him in the face. <laughs> and then say, but that's... That but, fails the mission, I think. I, maybe. It might. It might. <laughs> it said capture alive only, so you might have... Oh, capture alive? Oh, okay, yeah. Then, yeah, it's a failure. I'm like, I'm like what happens if I shoot him? Oh, there, mister. In front of his wife and kid. <laughs> that's how revenge Stop. movies start. <laughs> Just be real quiet back there. No! Come on. Son of a bitch. We, get, we have to slap him. I do it. Funny <laughs> that he chopped off the horse and then he immediately got fucking hit by my horse. Like he wiped out. Hey, you don't mind, do you? Uh -oh. Fuck you, Mister. Your carrots and your salt and venison. Don't mind me, sir. Trust me. Guess what just came out? What? Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe just came out for PS5 and 4. Really? Yeah, I've been waiting for it to come out so long. It's on the list of games we're doing, and I'm like, yes, it finally came out, but we can't do it yet. Not yet. Damn it. And, then, and there's like 20 new endings. Like there used to be 19 endings, and now there's like 20 new endings. There's like 40 endings. You can find now. I'm just like, no, why'd you have to come out? And it came out on 427, which is the number of employee 427. They did it on purpose. They're fucking smart, that company. The game's so smart with that game. It's just meta and smart. But yeah, we have to wait. We have other games to do. We'll get there when we get there. Let's see about this. I hate that. It's like, games come out when we're doing other hey, games. Mister. Yeah. It's so oh, annoying. No. And then King Wars 4 is coming out, and we have to still do other games. It's like, why? I'm afraid King Wars 4 is going to be shit. Might be fine. Might be. Might be. 3 was it. Uh, I didn't think 3 would be like a polarizing one, but we liked it, so. We might like this one. I guess it's just I get scared when there's like a fourth one like the third one ended it so yeah. perfectly and then there's a fourth one What are you gonna do with the story now like I don't know That's what I'm concerned about. I'll get back to your point in a moment Well, this guy like his friends showed up to try to like break him free and I shot him to death Come on, man. And I think him getting off my horse was scripted Name's Mark Johnson. You can only run so long, son. There's your cell. You're lucky it's not a grave. I was out in the bite of you. Wasn't hurting no one. Maybe you weren't, but those partners of yours were a rough bunch. Go to hell. That's the price for Johnson. I didn't take it, someone else would have. Tell yourself that, bounty hunter. You ain't whiter than white. I hope your past catches up with you. Don't you believe in redemption? I worked the land, I raised the family, I redeemed myself. Please! You ran, and you kept running. Don't twist this any other way. I guess we're gonna go see Mary now. All we're seeking. The poster will be done and in the station in no time hence.
Alright, we're gonna go see Mary Linton now, I guess? Yeah, we'll go see Linton. Alright, we should be doing how we do on time. We have an hour and fifty minutes. We only that was only Yeah, we're fine. We're still doing good. Hey there, mister! Is that only ten minutes? Yeah, that was only ten minutes. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. yeah. We'll, we'll be in main missions in no time. I don't know why it felt longer. I wasn't bored, but it was like that. I'm like, huh, I didn't think that was that short. I didn't think that'd be that fast. <laughs> yeah, there's a reason I did that bounty. Um, but you know later why. Well, I did hear the word redemption, and it's in the title of the game, so I'm wondering if that's going to come back later. Like, you did say, what, you don't believe in redemption? or and I was like, okay, they are going to do something with this, because redemption is in the title of the game. His arc is like another character's arc. And it will show up later in the main story. Probably. Yes. I'll let you know. Because obviously you don't want to spoil It'll be shit. a long time. Past that waypoint, so that's good news. We're at chapter four already. Yep, we're at chapter four. Alright, six? Five uh, or six? Six and then two epilogues. Six and two epilogues, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. There's epilogue one and epilogue two. That's right. Yeah, it sets up uh, Red Dead 1, kind of, not really. I think it does. Which we may or may not be able to do, depending on if I can even find it. Yeah. <laughs> if you can even play it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We might be able to do Red Dead 1 if I can't find it. I mean, the last remaster Rockstar did of their games was fucking ass. Because yeah. they outsourced it. <laughs> yeah, so we may not be able to do Red Dead 1. But this game's better. We're going to play Red Dead Redemption 1 remastered. and It's going to be shit. It's gonna and like... John's going <laughs> to T-pose and sink into a floor. <laughs> and, like, the horse is going to T-pose somehow. <laughs> So you won't be mad if we skip Red Dead 1 and if we can't find it, that's that We'll just copy. watch all the cutscenes. Yeah, that's probably what we're gonna have to do. Yeah. <laughs> Is someone there? Anything to spare for a blind man? There you go, oh, friend. Bless you, mister. Truly, you're a saint. <laughs> yes, sir. There should be more people in the world like you. God bless. So Mary is in St. Denise? Yep. Get the finder. Towers are. Come here, so You think you're so funny? What's gotten in? I just you? remember our time here in St. Denis. Was it St. Denis where we found that racist man and we pinned him up against the Yes. Bank? Yes. And then. Then a rose, we Arthur! met the other racist man. Arthur! Then we shot him and burned his corpse. I'm here! <laughs> you came! Yeah. I came. So, uh, what do you need? Wait there! I'm coming straight down! This better be worth our time, Mary. This better not be a fetch quest or something crazy. Arthur, I need you to find five bear asses. Skin them and give them to me. Arthur! <laughs> no. Hello, Mary. You came. Sure. Hello there. Whenever you call for me, I'll come. Oh, Arthur. What's wrong? Daddy. Your father? I'm a bigger fool than I even thought. I, I'm begging you, Arthur. I know Daddy was not kind to you, but but surely you cannot hate a man for the sin of loving his daughter and wanting better for her than... Than, than me? Than the choices you what make. What choice did I have? Did I ever have? Oh, I know. You had to live by your code. But your code is... It's not right. Has your way been right, Mary? With you? And Jamie joining a bunch of crazies? And hypocritical daddy with his drinking and whoring and gambling? Huh? Is that what a pure life has gotten you? Begging me for help? Oh, Arthur. Be kind to me. Please. I'm sorry. I am... I should have asked someone else, but... But I'm the best guy you know at frightening decent people. It wasn't that I didn't love you, Arthur. 
You know that. Mm. Oh, Arthur. We were so very young. Think how different life could have been. Yeah, I think about it. A lot. I, it all seems so long ago and far away now. Will you help me try to save Daddy? Come along, Dan. Where are we going? What's the old lovable patriarch been up to now? Oh, Arthur, you know sarcasm is beneath you. He's been gambling and drinking and other things. Oh, the filthy rotter. Where can we find him? He said he was going down to the Theodore Eckhart stables. Something about a horse. It's down by the water in the warehouse district near the train yard. Come on, then. Don't be a pompous ass, Arthur. It doesn't suit you. Oh, oh, should I leave that to Daddy? Leave Daddy alone. He suffers enough. Well, I suppose I can take some consolation in that. No, oh, Arthur. I should have ran away with you years ago. Well, you wouldn't. No, I didn't. But... Well... I, I don't know. So what do you think he's up to? I'm not sure. He keeps saying What's it's a disgrace, a man of his standing has to ride around on some old nag. Standing? He's usually falling down. Arthur. He wasn't always this way. But it has got worse. He's drinking and gambling more than ever. Pawning things off left and right. Mixing with bad people. I'm just scared for him. Don't worry too much. Whatever it is, we'll work it out. This is the place. Let me go in and see what kind of a state he's in. Sure. I'll wait here. Good luck. Scream if you need any help. Very funny. You can't stand there. What, in the street? Yes, in the street. Is it your street? Just get out of here. Why? I said, just get out of here. Listen, partner. I'm waiting on the lady. She's a fine lady. She's just gone inside. If I wasn't waiting on this lady, you'd be dead already. But if you continue to irritate me, I'll kill you. And make my apologies to the lady it's your call. Oh, I didn't mean nothing. Never been so to me in my life. Apology accepted. Oh, my own wait daughter. right there. I have half a mind. To kill you myself. Daddy. No. Oh, it's Daddy, please come home. You're tired, Daddy. Tired. I and have unwell. no such thing. You get away from me. You head home. I insist upon it. Leave me be. Damn nuisance. Excuse me, partner. Still as charming as ever, I see. Oh, Arthur. He's up to no good. We better follow him. Okay. Take your distance, you'll be spotted, and then you'll fail the mission. This way. Down here. He went around the corner. Heading toward that factory. You can see why he has such a high opinion of himself. We'll just follow the smell. Mary Stroper, she hates sarcasm. <laughs> One of her tropes. He just went between those
Come here, quick. Mind where you go. Mind where you go. Sorry? Do you think he saw us? I don't think so. What did you say to me? I didn't say a thing insulting. I'll wipe that goddamn smirk clean off your face. <laughs> Ain't you a little old for brawling, mister? Damn you! He's heading across the road. You know, this is kind of fun. Shh. He'll hear you. You cleaned yourself up a bit. I didn't realize I was here to impress anyone. He just went left down that alleyway. What's he doing? Let's go find out. Don't say I never show you a good time. I'm just glad you're here. Yeah, we we're no game. We're following. Side of him. What's he doing? What do you think he's doing? Well, he's either waiting for a woman of dubious morals, or he's trying to sell something. So, Ashton, you got the money? Seems he's selling something. Have you got the brooch, Mr. Gillis? Yes. Here. Yeah. Here's the money. <laughs> mm, that is beautiful. It's a family heirloom. That was it's mother's brooch. Not any longer, Mr. Gillis. Enjoy the money. And should you need any more, I can offer you a loan at a very reasonable rate of interest. No, thank you. I've heard what happens to folks who take loans from you. It's not I've his to sell. No, it's just a brooch. At least he didn't get himself come, killed. Come, you don't understand. Nice. Mother left it to me. You sold my mother's brooch? How could you? You! That's theft! Oh, speaking of thieves, I, I see you found your outlaw again. Hello, sir. Have you been well? Daddy, how could you? Mary, wait here. I'll go get the brooch. Don't hurt anyone, Arthur. It did not want to move. It did not. Oh, the fuck's the horse got to move? You hear me, stop the damn coach! Oh, he probably thought, yeah, I lost him. And then here he comes, this white God horse.
Fucked up, fuck boy. Oh! But you got wagon privileges. I got wagon privileges. Oh, Ashton's in it. Yeah. What I thought happened yeah. was I threw Ashton out, <laughs> out of it into like the road. Like, oh god, I think I killed him. <laughs> well, you got your fucking stagecoach back. No, oh, we levered over people first. <laughs> <laughs> no, can you? Did Gillis put you up to this? Do you know who I am? I bought that roach fair and square. And Gillis is to sell. I bought it fair and square. How much do you want for it? I guess I could give it to you for a hundred dollars. Well, you have money to burn anyway. Yeah, thank Here. you. Here, one hundred dollars. Take the damn thing. Crazy son of a bitch. You don't know who you're messing with. Somebody's gonna pay for this. Yeah, we'll call that back later in the story, probably. Give, right. me, give me some extra money. Naval compass. Platinum earrings. Silver ring. Watch. Coins, 13 bucks. We pretty much made half the money we gave to him I back. I think I pretty much just have my money back. No, you got half your money back. Right? You got 50 bucks back. You should have to ride the stagecoach back to your horse, or you could just call to your horse. Not again! Yep. Oh, no. <laughs> Okay. I was, I was like, wait a minute. It's like, wait a minute. What I was doing was I was freeing the horses, and then I was gonna like let them go, and then I whistled my arms and went, not again! So, oh, wait, wait, I, I gotta get on the wagon. Then I went on the wagon, it went forward automatically, and I ran over that horse. Like, damn! Who's your father? I don't know. You want me to? Find him again? When I said made my money Not back, really. I meant like me selling the stuff that I looted from my wagon might have given me my money back. I'll take you to the truck. Thank you. I can't believe I threw the driver off like a bridge. <laughs> yeah, got you your brooch back. I won't ask. Probably best not. Hey. What are you doing now? Right this moment? Why, well, yes. Uh, well, I was wondering if you wanted to do something. Uh, head to the theater, perhaps. Uh. Theater? Me? Sure, why not? It'll be fun, Arthur. Let's go to the Relure. They have the strangest acts. <laughs> strangest I can handle. Well, it's the normal business of life. I can't seem to get a grip on it. <laughs> you and me both, Arthur. Oh, I've missed you. Don't start. <laughs> You're an idiot. But you'll always be my friend. Well, of course I'm your friend, but... <laughs> you ain't always fair with me. If I was fair with you and a good person, I'd have had you hanged a long time ago. Well... 
That's true. <laughs> so, shut up and act like a gentleman, or at least try to for once in your brainless life. You're not a very nice woman, Mrs. Lane. <laughs> well, look at the company I keep. I know, it's quite dreadful, isn't it? <laughs> it's sort of beautiful in a gaudy and tasteless way. It's the only way I know. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, no, I didn't mean it like that. I'm sure. <clears throat> You silly man. Come on. Let's go find our seats. How about here on the right? Sure. After you. since Nero himself. Do not doubt. As a child, when I walked the horse manure covered streets of Saint Denis, I never Who dreamed the of the stir the thing, I would create right? so, in this locality. I think so. Just starting or not. Are you in a rush? The greatest Arthur? show ever assembled. Prepare Mace. for the greatest Mace. excitement of your Mace. curiosity. I guess I'm like fuck off and shit as I want. And magic. <laughs> I encourage any of you to dabble in all three if you have a settled aversion to manual labor as I do. How the entertainment that? is a gift that will see you through the winter better than any packed larder or root cellar full of canned goods. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome a truly stunning musical performance to the stage, Miss Robin Koninsky! Was that the antagonist option? No, no. Because <laughs> I wouldn't make it. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> if you can't antagonize me, no, I've been to Valentine! <laughs> Asshole Arthur is fun. <laughs> I 
1899 didn't get it right yet. Yeah, I, I guess. Perfect. You seen it? Oh, I see you, you. You love her dulcet tones, That's right? It. Yes. She is pure spectacle. And I assure you, she can charm any beast. Any beast at all, from cockroach to killer whale. <laughs> Your mother most likely told you not to play with fire. Or to spend time in the company of strange women. <laughs> you are about to do both. <laughs> Miss Antoinette Sanserino. Stop it. Look at that. can see how this could go horribly wrong. I hope she stays away from the curtain. That was cheering. That was cheering. <laughs> cheering. version where if you keep like antagonizing she burns herself I think I don't remember or something <laughs> it is oh, I got out there. Hey, there's guys. a place in France where the naked ladies dance. I have been there. Prepare for the body braziers of the Petit Flaneur in Gay Paris. Oh, oh, no. I don't think they're naked.
Oh, incredible! Aren't they lovely? Oh, those legs are a sight right. to behold. I just texted I'm in the group chat. All right. <laughs> new time eight o'clock. Each of my shows is news. truly because incredible. Oh, inspiring, and I'm so sure good. you enjoyed. Thank you. No, it's not we floundered through the morass. Yeah, well, one you day. That's with that's only fine. bright moments like these before I had the plans anyways with you so it wasn't to be anyway in silence. Yeah. so thank so. you what a lovely evening come back tomorrow yeah do it well now I'm not rushing down the theater there I'm are uh, different theater things that can happen if you just go like on your own you might have a chance to like help in an uh, act well Shall we? Where um yeah. some guy would be like, fun, shoot me in the mouth, I will catch the bullet, <laughs> and then you'd be like, okay, right. and he will actually catch the, the fucking bullet. Now, Mr. Morgan. I would thought he get shot in the face. <laughs> that would be the end of it. But <laughs> you can shoot him in other amazing. spots. He'll be like, what the sure. fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is for the trolley. So while well, you wait for the trolley, you go to the theater. My life she goes on the wasn't trolley. supposed yeah. to. It's a time waster. Oh, a little bit. Is it too late for us, Arthur? I can't lie to you. I'm a wanted man, Mary. If I, if anyone close to me, well, they're wanted too, and I can't have you wrapped up in that. But it's come to an end. This time, it really is. Run away with me, Arthur. Run away right now, and don't look back. Got some people I need to take care of. All right, your mother says it's fine. Once they're free, then All I'm right. free. Then I can disappear. But Arthur, if we're gonna run away anywhere, we need money. Hey, at least they let us know now, and not like at the last minute. Yeah, I'll have right. some. I know you won't run away. But it's a pretty dream. Very pretty. But I will once I get some money. I had some. Then some fool got her trapped into a town and I can't go back to. It's another story. I'll write you. I'm fine. I should be able to make it back. That was a long mission, that was 30 minutes. Yeah, that was a while. 
Okay, I guess we're going to go see Hosea now. Catch your wagon, take it to the... Oh, four, in a minute 45, but we kept fucking yeah, around. Yeah, dude. Because <laughs> we speed to running. Around. Like it's almost like all right, speed running. All right, so what are we doing first? I Jose or Mary Beth? Let's see. I think it's Jose then Mary. It's Jose then Mary. Yes, I'm 100 percent sure. But I remember talking to you about. It all right, we're gonna week. go back to Shady Bell. We'll have time to do at least. Hopefully at least two or three main missions. Voice is out of whistling range. No! Ah, oh, shit. shit. What do you mean it's out of whistling Mister? range? You're in town. Hello. You didn't come with me? <laughs> Where the fuck are you? Oh, is it all the way? You better not be. <laughs> well, Arthur, you oh. ready to go on the marathon? <laughs> Last time we needed that horse, it fucking stood, stood there while we whistled for it. And I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> Snoky, what the shit? I don't feel like it. Are you just gonna run to the exit to find your horse? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll run to the sunset. I could have got back together with my girlfriend, but I couldn't fucking do that shit. <laughs> I had to get the money. I need my fifth money. And we run away and do whatever the fuck we want. That is whatever the fuck you want, money. Hey, what the hell? Fuck you. Ooh. What the hell? Why are you running? Officer. Officer. Hello, is there a waypoint for the horse you can make? I can. Map. Arthur's horse is all the way over there. Alright, we're almost there. It's just a half a mile. I'm just trying to make your life easier. Like, isn't there a waypoint for the horse? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's like, why are we just gonna. Look Very appreciated. Thank you. GG, <laughs> <laughs> you saw some cow by Paul ass. It cow. is all the way where you were. Yep, it's all the way. He, it just stood there. It's oh my there. fucking god. Oh no, wait, here it comes. Better not fall in the fucking swamp. That, will, that won't happen, but. <laughs> This horse has done amazing things. I don't see the horse. Maybe I'm blind. No, it's going. It's coming. Here it is. There you are. <laughs> it's like, hey, I made it. Oh, no. I miss? Oh, a lot. You missed a lot. Yeah. It was on our way there anyway. Yeah. We were right. Yeah, we're right there. Almost... All right, we're going to go to the Shady Bell now. All right, this might be a good place to stop because you're about to do a main mission. Peace out.